this is now a short demonstration uh, of the current state of my Pi Flow uh, FreeCAD uh, workbench. I have created for testing purposes uh, a workbench Pi Flow, and uh, there are at the moment three commands: a test scenario, a test BP is the same where I start the main window uh, of the PyFlow environment to see if something here doesn't work. Uh, uh, does it work in in the default environment to see where is the, the bug? A reset is a method to reload all the libraries for uh, development, so I do not have to work with the reload uh, command in Python because the handling is different in Python 2 and Python 3. Uh, okay, when I start here uh, this command, uh, I get uh, a scenario, I get uh, three objects uh, which are already uh, connected to FreeCAD. Um, FreeCAD node uh, I do not work at the moment on this. Uh, I have here the console, the report view window uh, object here. And here is a vector object with uh, three inputs, x, y, and z. In this case, I have uh, here two floats. I can here change the value of one float and the value of the second float. And in my vector, um, I only can change the not linked uh, Z coordinate. And my vector produces a free cat uh, vector object, vector out. And I can send it to the console. So when I execute the vector, in this case, my vector is computed. And my console says the coordinates here. And when I change the value and re-execute, I see uh, the results. And what we have here is really a free cat vector. And I can here set a flag warning. And in this case, when I send a message, I get here a warning output. So the console uh, window is configurable here for the moment between information or message and warning. And here uh, I can send information. Uh, when I work with the scenario, I can save it to a file somewhere. I say I call it Z10 JSON. Okay, then I can change it all and can load it. and I get it back. Um, this is a refresh button. When I change something values here, then I can uh, with refresh uh, uh, reload the layout. And here is the properties tool. If I click uh, on a node, I get the property dialog of this node. I can work with this and when I close the dialog with properties tool, I can reopen it here and I click again on a node and I get the properties here. Um, okay, uh, what is the structure we have in uh, PyFlow packages? Uh, one package FreeCAD and in FreeCAD at the moment I have three nodes, the FreeCAD a console object, the FreeCAD node, and the FreeCAD vector. I have demonstrated the work of these two ones. And we have here a pin, uh, the vector pin for a three-dimensional vector. I will start to add other pins to say rotation pin and some other interesting things next days. And uh, Function libraries at the moment are still empty, but uh, we can reuse uh, the package pyr here. There are a lot of 
uh, libraries and I will uh, port the vector3pi to the freeCAD vector library as the next example.